What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another Gotham Knights video. So in this video, we're going to be talking about each of the core four characters specialities. So before we get into this video, make sure you guys drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitter. Link will be in the description. Join the Discord, everything like that, because I'm going to be covering a lot of Gotham Knights, whether it be news, potential DLCs, um, stuff we now know about the game, when they get announced, and that sort of stuff. So, um, yeah, like I said, this video is going to be about each character's speciality, and uh, although we've been told that the majority of this is going to be based off customization, there's certainly a strength to each character when it comes to combat. So, the so first one we're going to talk about is Red Hood. Of course, Red Hood uses high-tech weaponry alongside traditional firearms. Now, we're believed to have seen a cap in uh, in his guns, in his handguns, in the trailer, which makes it seem like, obviously, if you don't watch the trailer, if you just watch the trailer once, you'll notice that, well, you'll assume that he's just killing people, but obviously it looks like, it looks more along the lines of he's got a cap in the um in the gun so basically they're like just knocking them out i mean he's not actually killing people um as you would think red hood to do um but yeah obviously he's the weapons expert he's going to be using a lot of weapons we haven't seen a sword from him yet but maybe that's something that we'll be able to unlock further down the line in the game um but yeah i'd like to see him have a sword as well a traditional sword as well as all the other obviously the uh the guns and the weaponry that he has then we move on to robin now according to what we know robin has a background in psychological warfare and in combat he obviously uses the quarter staff and stealth and um, you're seen in the trailer where he turns invisible and also you are but he's believed to as well were believed to see him teleport so that could be uh, a bit of a weird com uh, mechanic obviously uh, seeing him teleport around the map and um, to get out of combat as well as invisibility and stealth is going to be very very cool especially if you can get i wonder if you'll be able to unlock some sort of stealth suit that we saw in young justice you know like an all black robin suit that could be really cool to see uh, especially if you're uh, going after people in the night uh, obviously like i said the quarter staff as well is very very cool uh, batgirl uses martial arts and they i believe it's pronounced is it tonfa which is her weapons which uh uh interesting alongside the hacking abilities as well because obviously she uh, used to be in the chair um well the person in the chair doing all the hacking and stuff um so yeah obviously that could be kind of cool obviously we've seen her with the cape as well being able to like f not fly but float around and glide um so that could be a kind of kind of a cool mechanic obviously martial arts gonna have some great combos to be able to use uh for her as well and then also we have Nightwing, who uses his sticks. A scream? Is it a sc is it a screamer sticks? I don't know how to pronounce it, but he uses his sticks for his uh, acrobatic attack style. And uh, yeah, so he's going to be very very fast. Obviously, he's going to be able to do a lot of uh, acrobatics, flips, rolls, all that stuff. And obviously the sticks as well. Now, Nightwing, I've said multiple times, is going to be my main. I'm going to use him first. But I'm going to be interested to use all of them and uh, try and master all of their own uh, their own specialities because Red Hood with his weaponry could be kind of cool to use as well. And obviously certain situations are going to be better for certain characters. So maybe you've got a bit of decision making to uh, do there. Like obviously if you've got a stealth mission, you'd rather take Robin than any of the others because he's a... Um, he's the best at stealth because he can go invisible and um, so yeah either way it's going to be uh, interesting to see that obviously we kind of got um semi teased as well with uh, some other information and uh, that information was um someone asked the question are we going to see more characters and they said we'll have more information uh, about uh, starting characters in the future so that could be interesting to see obviously we've done the video on the dlc characters and uh, i'll probably end up doing more videos on dlc characters at some point as well because there is so many characters that we could do we could have a a prequel dlc where we play as batman finally but that's for a separate video so uh, yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh this quick little video nothing too special just wanted to uh 
notify you guys that there is a speciality for each character which is interesting and it's going to be great to see and uh, let me know in the comments who you're going to be using first who's going to be your main character is there anything you're looking forward to is there anything you want to see in the game i will have a video on some theories that i have for the game because i have a couple of good theories uh including uh, batman still being alive and um yeah i'm going to be interested to see how how this game folds out because it has the potential to be one of the best games the best open world games that we will we will see because the customization the gameplay looks fantastic the graphics look amazing obviously the game has the game's available to be pre-ordered now i was actually looking on one of my uh on, my, on the internet and there's actually a lot of places that are already taking pre-orders of course there is no release date yet but as soon as we find out the re release date i will make a video on that as well and um, so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this uh, quick little video what i will do is i'll probably leave you guys with a little bit more gameplay and um, so hopefully you guys stick around for that but without further ado hopefully you guys enjoyed the video be sure to drop the video a like subscribe if you have not already and i'll see you all in the next one peace In breaking news, we've received reports of an explosion somewhere north of the We're city. We're still waiting for the police to confirm if there are any victims. This story is evolving rapidly. Please bear with us. We are just really loud. Boom. There was smoke everywhere. The emergency services have confirmed that they've discovered a body buried in the wreckage. We're still waiting for further details. Any emergency vehicles it appears are that a large portion of the building has actually collapsed. International news, an explosion rocked Gotham City earlier today. We are now able to confirm that billionaire philanthropist Bruce Wayne is... If you're watching this, I'm dead. This is a code black. This message was automatically triggered when I destroyed the cave and everything it contained. We both know it won't take long for Gotham's criminals to realize the Batman is gone. And you can't count on the GCPD. They haven't trusted us since Jim died. Gotham will need its protectors more than ever. I'm leaving you the Belfry as base of operations. Some of the technology is outdated, but it has the gear you need and all of my files. You've always had my back when I needed you. I know you'll keep Gotham safe. Good luck. And goodbye.
No one talks about them. Not a whisper word is said. For if you try to crush them, then the town strikes you dead.